Hello my Hello Kitty fans, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to make a video on the latest McDonald's Happy Meal toy with collaboration with Hello Kitty. So I feel like this video is going to be a little bit more of a rant. There were nine Happy Meal Hello Kitty Yu-Gi-Oh toys to collect and they did start a month ago actually and McDonald's will be now recycling to the newest toy which they're going to be selling now, the little mini Crocs keychain which I think are going to be so cute and I cannot wait to get at least one of those. Nevertheless, I wanted to go over a little bit about the collaboration with McDonald's and Hello Kitty Yu-Gi-Oh! toys. Now I don't know about you, but I did not have a lot of success collecting these toys. They started a month ago, like I said, and I was ready, I was pumped up, I got into my Hello Kitty outfit, and then I went. And some of the McDonald's, even though they were releasing that day, they didn't have the toys or they were like, we don't know what you're talking about. And I'm like, uh, you have a poster right there on the wall stating that, you know, the McDonald's Yu-Gi-Oh toys are releasing today. And so a lot of them were just like not cooperating, I felt. Now, uh, I don't know if it was from previous releases uh, of other Happy Meal collaboration toys that they just will not take calls from you. They will not answer what toy are we releasing that day. They just say you order the Happy Meal and you get what you get. That's pretty much the attitude that I got. And let me tell you that I went to like five McDonald's and I got like the same kind of feedback. So some were nice, some were kind of rude, um, but nevertheless, they were not gonna help you. They were not gonna help you. And here I am seeing on Instagram, I'm seeing on Facebook that people already had the whole collection. And I'm like, I can't even get two, you know. I do live on the West El Paso side of town. And that is what I got from my experience. So my son was also helping me collect these toys. He is a big Yu-Gi-Oh fan. And so he thought, you know, I'll help you collect them because I also like them as well. And he was also not having much luck as well. So nevertheless, I was not able to collect all of them. Let me show you the ones I was able to collect. I do like to collect the Happy Meal box. Um, I do like to put it on my wall. I only have two. This would be the second one. Let me show you the ones I was able to collect and then we'll talk about my final thoughts. So these are all the ones that I was able to collect and I was able to get 15 of them. And let me tell you that that is so much food that I think I really, really need a break. Cute. I have not opened not even one, but let me tell you. So let's go ahead and start off with Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty, I was able to get one. Cinnamon Roll, I was able to get three. My Melody, I was able to get three. Kuropi, I was able to get two of them. Pom Pom Perrine, I was able to get two of them. Karomi, I was able to get one. Tuxedo Sam, I was able to get two. Pocacho, I was able to get one. So here I only have eight of them and that is because the very last one, Choco Cat, I did not find it. I was not able to get it from any McDonald's here. Um, uh, my son was helping me look on the east side part of town. He, was, he wasn't finding it. We were calling and we were going. Um, because they were some of the McDonald's were not giving you a lot of information over the phone. Some of them they were not even answering the phone. Um, so as my son was trying to do this on the east side of town, I was trying to work the west side of town. Not getting in and of course this was within like the month that uh, of course the Happy Meal Hello Kitty toys was going on. It wasn't all this in like the search in one day. Um, but we were just not successful and as every week or every like three days was passing, they were starting to release a new one but for whatever reason we were not able to get Choco Cat. I even uh, joined a group on Facebook that I believe it's in Mexico but I think it's in deep Mexico that I just don't think that there was any way that I would be able to still try to get them. So for here for the US they were in little plastic baggies. In Mexico however in other parts that they released the same collaboration they were in mini boxes. It would have been cool if we would have got little mini boxes because that would have been something else that I would be 
been able to collect for this collaboration uh, but we got the little plastic baggies so the Facebook group that I joined from Mexico that they were all saying I have all these extras and then they, they were giving the price of how much they were selling for each um, there was just no way even though I would have been able to get a Choco Cat because the prices that they were selling them for was I'm like no I'm not gonna pay that price I, I want it but not that it's not that important to me that I'm gonna drop a lot of money on trying to collect these because as it is I had to spend I got a total of 15 of these little charms which means that I had to buy 15 Happy Meals and let me tell you that that is so much food that I ate this month that uh, I was able to notice a difference so that is not good guys so I do need to give my body a break from the past two collaborations that McDonald's has had with Hello Kitty Happy Meals um, I do want to say that I'm a little disappointed I'm a little disappointed because this is so easy uh, and cheaply to make. This did not cost much to make versus the other years that they're actually toys. They're actually toys that you were able to move. They were plastic, they're, they're keepsakes. Um, and, uh, and this to me is not, it can't even stand on its own. You have to hang it, which is fine. Uh, but nevertheless, I think that the quality of the actual items that they're trying to collaborate with Hello Kitty is just going less and less, in my opinion. And and this and I'm just talking about the Happy Meal toys. I'm not talking about any other company and or collaboration with Hello Kitty. This is the last two collaborations that they've had that they've included Hello Kitty. There was a, it was actually a movable toy, a plastic toy that it did something. You opened it up and there was like stickers or there was something that it did. I'll say though that the little pillows as I'm calling them are very vivid the the image are very detailed and so I'm sure that you have some of these you know exactly the picture on this is very detailed They're, they don't look worn out um, but nevertheless I really wish that they would have been an actual like little miniature toy of something some movable part something that I able to have it stand on its own or something like that I do also notice that the collaboration that they had in Mexico where they actually had the little boxes instead of these little plastic baggies they also included Bats Maru and in the one here in the US they did not include Bats Maru so I don't know why what's up with that each I believe that each of the Hello Kitty and friends are licensed separately they have like their own different licensing is what I'm understanding of course Hello Kitty has her own licensing um, and I believe that my Melody and Karomi have been licensed together for a lot of the things that I've seen they're kind of paired together uh, either way um, so that's what I noticed that for the US Bats Maru was not released to pair with Yu-Gi-Oh so Bats Maru is paired with a Yu-Gi-Oh character but it just that character was just not released here in the US if you guys have any information on that please drop comments down below and let us all know why 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 did we not get the boxes why did we get the plastics and why was not Bats Maru included in the US uh, release for McDonald's and Happy Meal collaboration so those are just my final thoughts um, nevertheless I am very happy that uh, McDonald's Happy Meal did collaborate with Sanrio and Friends again. I hope that they do make another collaboration. We might not see it in years. It did take quite a while for them to do another collaboration with Hello Kitty. I hope that they don't wait too long um, and I hope that hopefully we'll see another collaboration in 2025. I'm not sure. I want you to let me know were you able to collect all of them? Were you missing any? Which ones were you missing? And how many Happy Meals did you buy? How many Happy Meals did you eat? So you already know my number. I ate 15 of them. Wow, that is a lot. I want to thank you so much for watching this video please give this video a thumbs up if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell notification to notify you of when I upload a new Hello Kitty video thank you so much for watching and have a great day